Shalom brothers and sisters. Just a short touch on Revelation 22 verse 7 to 21. Behold, I come quickly. Blessed is he that keepeth the sayings of the prophecy of this book. And I, John, saw these things and heard them. And when I had heard and seen, I fell down to worship before the feet of the angel which shewed me these things. Then saith he unto me, See thou do it not, for I am thy fellow servant, and of thy brethren the prophets, and of them which keep the sayings of this book, worship God. And he saith unto me, Seal not the sayings of the prophecy of this book, for the time is at hand. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. He which is filthy, let him be filthy still. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. And behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me to give every man according as his work shall be. I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last. Blessed are they that do his commandments, that they may have right to the tree of life and may enter in through the gates into the city. For without are dogs and sorcerers and whoremongers and murderers and idolaters and whosoever loveth and maketh a lie. I, Jesus, have sent mine angel to testify unto you these things in the churches. I am the root and the offspring of David, and the bright and morning star. And the spirit and the bride say, Come. And let him that heareth say, Come. And let him that is athirst come. And whoever will, let him take of the water of life freely. For I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book, If any man shall add unto these things, God shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book. And if any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, God shall take away his part out of the book of life and out of the holy city and from the things which are written in this book. He which testifieth these things saith, Surely I come quickly. Amen. Even so, come, Lord Jesus, the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. Amen. Now six times he says, Come, Lord Jesus. Everybody's saying, Come, Lord Jesus. The seventh reference to the word coming is an invitation for those who want to come that thirst. So the insights in the Greek words, first coming, erkomai, translating as I come seeking fruit and I am coming. Jesus is coming and he's coming seeking fruit, the same way he sought fruit from the fig tree when he walked past it. He comes seeking fruit, and he is coming. The second Greek word here used for come in reference to Jesus is erku, come and see, and as a voice of thunder, come, which perfectly matches in with our rapture, with the voice of an archangel. The voice of thunder, come, and come and see, he is coming. Then six times the word is used, and six in Hebrew is referenced with a vav. Six often refers to the works of man, but ideally represents sacrificial love and intimate knowledge with the Creator. When the latter is forsaken, only idolatry and flesh remain. One is always either projecting the image of God or the image of the beast. Yot, hey, vaf, hey. Behold the hand, behold the nail. The six here connecting us to God. 
Let all of us who are waiting eagerly say, Come, Maranatha, we await you, Lord Jesus. Shalom.